new episode of the Tony Tell Show, Down River Live. Just got there kicking it with Coco, Mike McDaniels, Mike Larry in the building. Got some new cash here tonight. Had my number. Trying my prices right joke tonight. We're gonna see what's up. Always lifelong dream. Been on prices right. We're gonna, I'm gonna make it come true tonight. So, all new episode, man. I just wanna go ahead and have a good time. You know what I'm saying? I'm honored to be on the show. So, <laughs> make it do the And away, away, away with this old news Cause nothing ever came from what I thought that I knew Just don't Hey, you ever have a dude follow you, look at your pictures and then unfollow you real fast? <laughs> don't it mess up your self-esteem? Like, what is, what is he, why? It's your boy Tony Tell. <laughs> Mike Larry. It's Mike McDaniel's birthday. You know what it saying? is, man. It is. It's the only way you can celebrate is having two hilarious ass black people. I'm thinking Mike's starting to think about his age, man. We're going to find out Mike's really 46. His outfits he be wearing be looking like he's about 27. <laughs> I know that man. hat old as hell. <laughs> Mike, that hat old, man. That's old old. Old Sammy Davis, baby. Oh, my God. Thanks for coming out for my birthday, special, y'all. It's only about five or six of us compared to the rest of them. Yeah, it's a bunch of, it's imaginary people back there. I imagine that if it was people back there, yeah. Y'all feeling good on a Friday night? Who works at that? That's what's up, my people got jobs. It's hard out here when you ain't got no job. You can tell who ain't got no job. All you gotta do is check your timeline. <laughs> <laughs> Selfies all day. Funeral flow. It's like, you just do something with your life. Cut that, cut that. What's going on with Roos? People be hype as hell on uh, Price is Right, don't they? Be up there hype as hell as soon as they get up. <laughs> 225, Bob. <laughs> don't know. You don't see too many black people on there, do you? Black people know we don't know the real prices for stuff because we always got somebody on the east side that got a deal. <laughs> you be hype. You be sitting up there chilling. I'm like, yeah, good luck, good luck. They bring this GNC washer, double tumbler, white trim, 415, 626, 311, 125, Bob. I had to call the dude right now, 125. I can throw an extra door on there if you want it. What a bus catches? Anybody ever caught the bus before? Make sure you call the bus. Cause the bus is crazy because there's always somebody out there that know everything about the bus, eh? You ever go to the bus stop, you at the bus stop, there's <laughs> already somebody there, and you ask him, you be like, hey man, what time is the bus supposed to be coming? That's what he tell you, uh, it, it's a 22, see, it normally gonna be around here, it should be coming any minute, now you know? Normally it's really running about 15 minutes late, hold on, let me see if I see it. There he is, right there. <laughs> you go out there and try and see the bus, see if you can see it. You be like. Yeah, I don't see no bus, bro. He be like, see, look at that, stupid. It's right down there. <laughs> he looking five miles down. He like, see it right down there behind the other truck, behind that other truck, behind that other truck. He be like. I don't see it, man. I'm about to go in here to this gas station, man. Get me something to eat real quick. Grab me a little Lucy or something, man. Let me know that bus come. <laughs> That's what he be like, hey, man, you don't want to do that. The bus, I'm telling you. The bus is right down there. He be like, oh, whatever, old man. You be in the gas station like, yeah, let me get a uh, little Snickers. No, fat man got to get Snickers. Let me get a Snickers. 
uh, two Lucy's and... Oh, oh God, I'm just... Why the old man always be on the bus like this? He told you. Told you not to go in there. He don't even look at you no more. You know, be honest with y'all, I can't afford to have her be here, but she came anyway. You know what I'm saying? So. So I ain't on the radio no more, but I still wake up at 4 o'clock in the morning, so I get up and go to the gym and get my workout on. Now y'all looking like, uh, I ain't working out. I, listen, I know if I go to the gym every day for the rest of my life, I ain't going to look like Beyonce, but I may feel like Beyonce. So I go to the gym and get my workout on and I feel good and, and, and I ain't got no booty but it's cool, it's all right. I don't want to, when I, I did, you know, I, I'm, I'm from the 60s, I'm 51 years old, so when I grew up, boobs was the thing. Now they got booties, I'm like, oh well. <laughs> this it, it's all you get. You know, this, this it. Stretch pants, boots. I'm from the hood, I'm from Highland Park. I can't say nothing about River Rouge at all. Ooh. I'm from the other end of River Rouge, Highland Park. That's where I'm from. And we used to play y'all football, River Rouge, Inkster, E-Course, Robichaud, all of that. Ooh, y'all was crazy back in the 70s and 80s. At the old spot, Inkster, they used to win the football games and want to turn our bus over. I'm like, niggas, y'all won, hello? And I was on the track team, I threw the shot put in discus, but I always kept an extra shot put because they wanted to fight. I'm like, no, you ain't gonna get me. I put it in a bra, I be swinging it like Thor. <laughs> I got some hood in me. I got some church in me, but God left a little bit of hood in me. So I fight different. I will, I will fight you. I'll be all like, ooh, that's you two old, I'm gonna fight. Listen, I will fight for real. I don't want to, but I will. And the only reason I'm fighting because my knee be hurting, so I don't want you to make me fall on the floor. Shut up, Mike Larry. <laughs> oh my God, I hope I don't trip on this. I'm going to have to play it off. Remember when people used to trip and play it off? You ever played it off too much? You ever do too much? I'm going to have to put the mic down for this. You ever do this? I did this one day. <laughs> I'll let y'all later. <laughs> what do people wear with roll rings? What do people wear with roll rings? Yeah. Oh, this is a rule. Watch y'all got Tell you, somebody pulled up on me today. People, because people be running everybody off the road, man. You, you ever been, I, I was with my girl one time, right? She got the, I want to just give them a look. You ever do that look? You ever see that? I'm riding with her. <laughs> I'm riding with her, somebody. Cut her off. She like, uh-uh, see, that's what I'm talking about. Hold on, hold on, I'm about to. She go right up to him and then do this. Like, what the hell did the look just do? Yeah, see, I had to get him together. <laughs> With the look? I realized something else, real rude, y'all ain't no joke, man. Y'all serious out here. I bought a little, I bought a little hood house out here, right? I guess I bought it on the wrong block. You know you buy something on the block, nigga, but you, no matter who buy it, it still ain't gonna be yours. I bought a house in his mind, you know what I'm saying? So I did something, I, what I did is I left my dog over there. I'm like, hey, look here, man, somebody try to come in here, you get there. The dog like, I got you. I come back next week, this dude was on the block barbecuing in my backyard and my dog on the fence like this. I said, man, what the hell are you doing? He's like, oh man, they good people, man. They cool as hell. Hey, put another hot dog on them. No, you ain't supposed to be cool with these fools. Cool with them, man. Uh -uh. Hey, yeah, we're gonna do some comedy.
when pigs fly. They do this. Try to change it, man. You ever get robbed and had somebody get robbed the person that was robbing you at the same time? I came up the store, he's like, give me your money right now. As soon as I heard, give me your money right now. I'm looking, he's like, man, I ain't got no money. I'm trying to get it. Well, hurry up, man. Hurry up. This dude ain't playing. I'm like, shit, I ain't playing. I'm giving them the money. He, had it. he gave it to him. He walked away. He still got the gun. No, I was like, dog, you can put that down. We both lost. I can't believe this. Hey, which way you going? You need a ride? Come on. Hey, wait, me. Thinking about Jesus Christ? Yes, Lord. Going to church this week. And I'm going to smoke first. Amen. Amen. In a relationship, make sure it's a relationship out right here. I was dating this lazy chick, man. Look, look. When he... <laughs> My man right here, he ain't no one to clap. <laughs> His girl clapped. He was like this. How long y'all been together, bro? Look, he don't even know he got to ask her. It's like a real question. Like, Can I phone a friend, bro? <laughs> I'll date this lazy chick, right? Date this lazy chick. But this is how I know she's lazy. Everything she do, she got to sit down. You know what I'm saying? Everything she do. When she whoop the kids, she got to sit down in a chair. She will never get out that chair. And she ain't handicapped or nothing. She just like to sit down in a chair. So she like, hey boo, can we go out to the club? You take me to the club? And so I'm like, what you gonna do, bring the chair? What was how are you? How this supposed to work? She was like, yeah, can we just bring the chair? <laughs> so we brought the chair. Cause I like it. We brought the chair. And this I know it's here, cause this song right here came on. You got that song, DJ? She was like, take my chair to the club! I took the chair out there, she was like, I'm about to kill you. That's why I date young men. I want an no old man. An old man got an all one color blue pants, blue socks, a blue belt. He got a port up, how one his goo goo stuck to the side of his leg. Y'all done seen him. He be talking, his teeth slipping, he trying to catch him like that. Like he want I don't like that, I don't like that. And then, oh man, could you please tell me why old men put so much jewelry on? They got like three rings on one hand and be doing their hand like this. What does that mean? You, like you trying to put a spell on me. What, why are you doing that? I don't like old men. Yes, I said, Z, I don't like them. Z. Old men got too many directions, too many instructions. They want you to do too much. And they always want to point out your flaws. You know, you're getting kind of thick there. Yeah. Well, you getting kind of bored there. Yeah. And old men, do me a favor. I love y'all. I just want to date you. Not to worry. 35 is my cutoff point. I'm, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. I, ain't gonna lie. I want to date a man. Me and his mama went to school together. She still thinks she a cheerleader. I didn't know River Rouge was this live. I swear, I got off the freeway. I thought I was on Call of Duty or some shit. 
is a walking dead. I had a whole bunch of cars on the freeway. I was like, yeah, I think this is my exit. Soon as I went off, I heard the walking dead entrance came on. I'm at the light, like, oh my gosh. Need to get up out of here. She was like, we need to stop at the gas station. She was like, what you want to get some gas? No, we need water, we need dry food. I don't know if we're going to leave out here. I don't see any more Christmas bulbs on the floor. <laughs> I think we got it all. Y'all can still hear me even though you can't see me. It's like God. Not, not me, per se. See, that's what I get. Y'all my friends, because y'all didn't have to come here, so I appreciate y'all taking y'all time and money to come out here, you know what I'm saying? Y'all, I appreciate y'all, I'm serious, I want y'all to know that, I'm from the bottom of my heart, that's why I'm going to give y'all this, this stuff on the necklace, because we really appreciate y'all coming out, because y'all don't have to. Don't this little hyper, man, you come in this one, that nigga gonna be like this. Hey man, put your mic. Hey man, hey man. 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 Hey man, when I looked at you and you had your phone, and you told me to play the mic, I turned around and I saw that. <laughs> like, damn, how long you been trying? <laughs> he told me to do whatever. That's why I asked you how much time you want me to do. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But two minutes. Well, when I seen you come off, I'm like, uh oh. I mean, I ain't got enough time. Right. I take my coat off. Niggas are really going to be mad. Hey, man, Mike, been up there an hour and 23 minutes. Oh, yeah. You take that coat and that hat off, dude. You be there. Yeah. Say, there's a lot of sexy women in here. I showed up when a lot of y'all showed up. Y'all was walking like y'all was walking into a club or something. You didn't, you didn't see girls walking into the building like they was coming to a school auditorium, did you? They get out, they walking out, they just sitting there with their hands in their pocket, ass hop. <laughs> you see the guy who got the bad girl with her? You see, they walk different. When you got an ugly girl, you walk a little bit different, don't you? You got an ugly girl, you walk in front of them. Like, hurry up, girl, get on in here. Hey, get out of here. <laughs> You still out there? Come on!